Hey, what's going on traders? This is Mike with Tactical Traders doing some end of the day scans today on June 7th, 2021. And right now I'm looking at ticker symbol SNDL and I'm on the 10 day 30 minute chart and we have a pretty interesting setup. Uh, actually, let's zoom out first and let's look at the yearly. Um, so I do have some old drawings on this. We did map out this um, chart a while back. You can go back on the channel. I believe we actually mapped this out way before it hit $3. Uh, when it was rough, roughly around 20 cents so this was a big mover for us so we definitely kept this on our radar obviously since then uh the price has pulled back a considerable amount it's pretty much drifting uh, lower until recently when we've had a, uh, another peak in interest uh, and you've seen the spike in volume now but let's go back down to that 10-day chart all right so this is going to be pretty much looking at the near term uh and we're just seeing that nice little pickup in price action setting a nice little, uh you know uptrend right here putting in some higher lows you can see that the 50 sma and the 200 sma both up in incline bullish fashion now we did top out some highs but we have uh pulled back you know from that putting in some lower highs as well and uh when we connect these data points we start seeing a pattern phone here uh, unfold here this is a symmetrical triangle uh basically a continuation triangle so we're looking for this to continue the overall trend which as we discussed earlier is in a bullish trend. You can tell by the 50 and 200 SMA. Uh, so we're gonna be looking for this range on price action to get tighter and tighter until it needs to make a move. Now some areas that we're gonna be looking at for it to get past and to keep above. Uh, first one off, I'm gonna say right here at this uh, $1.15. That has definitely been an area of resistance in the past. Now it started acting as an area of support, as you can see from these data points. It has slightly dipped below that. It has caught that trend line, though. So we're going to see if that 115 can hold there as a support. Uh, once we start getting past that, I'd say the 125 area is where I'm going to be setting my personal alert. Uh, after the 125, we're going to want to see a increase in volume at the same time. We're going to see that want to see that increase in volume at the same time to show us that there's a lot of bullish strength and momentum behind the move. After that, we can definitely see every testing the highs at 140, maybe taking a partial profit and then expecting a bigger breakout and letting our gains uh, run, run and continue to high, go higher. All right, traders, thank you for watching. If you like this very quick video, please hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. Thank you for watching, and until next time, stay profitable.